Hello guys, welcome to the next video on Linux command line tutorial for beginners. And in this video, we will learn how to use netstat command in Linux. Netstat stands for Network Statistics. And netstat is a command line tool which is used to display network connections, routing tables, and a number of network interfaces. And in addition, it can be used to, uh, you know, view network protocol state statistics. Okay. So to use netstat command, you can use uh, the keyword netstat and you can use few options with netstat command. So the first and the default uh, option which you can use with netstat is minus a. And when you give this uh, netstat minus a, it's going to show you all the, you know, connections which are available on your, uh, you know, system whether it's a TCP or UDP or Unix connections. And it's also going to display you the status if it's connected or it's listening or it's established and different kind of connection states, right? But when you give this command and when you scroll a little bit more up, you will be able to see that, uh, you know, you they have so many statistics you have you can see it has so many statistics that you uh, you know need to use some tool to you know view all these connection at the same time so what we are going to do is we will use this netstat which is this one with a pipe called less okay so thus just give this command netstat a and then this single pipe and then we are going to use the output to display with the less uh, command okay so when i press enter now you can see it's giving us the first line of output which can be you know displayed on the full terminal and whenever you want to see more you can just uh, press your down button and see more uh, you know more options so, so this is more flexible right now you can see uh, there are the state some are listening some are connected some are established you can see uh, the path of uh, this connection and you can see the type whether it's unix whether it's udp or it's tcp connection right and different state can be established listen or connected okay now let me clear the terminal once again uh, to quit this uh, netstat using a less command we already know that we you need to press q to quit and now we can use some more options with the netstat command so with uh, netstat you can use uh, T uh, option which stands for TCP so if you just want to see the TCP connections then you can use AT right and then press enter and it's just going to show you the TCP connections you can see the state and the you know you can see here the type of connection which is TCP only okay and once again press Q to come out of the command because we are using less to view this uh, output right in a similar way if you want to see the udp connections then you use u with this okay and then press enter and it's only going to show you the udp connections to you so we will con come out of uh, this output using q now the next option which we can use with nestat is the l flag and l flag will allow us to uh, see the output for the ports which are listening okay so l stand for listening state so just give minus l and now you can see whatever uh, you know programs are listening you can see the state all listening uh, states are showing and uh, nothing else right once again i will quit it now the next command is for example you want to see only listening 
TCP then use L and T for TCP and it's just going to show you the listening TCP connection and you may have guessed it correctly that if you want to see the listening UDP you just need to write LU okay and it's going to show you the listening UDP connections right now the next option which you can use with your uh, netstat command is the minus s flag and minus s flag is for statistics right so when you give minus s it's going to show you the statistics so press enter and you can see it's showing the statistics ip total uh, packets received uh, how many packets are received or how many packets are going out and you can see uh, which type of connection it is and then the you know properties of uh, these packets what are uh, what is happening so in the udp 78 packets are received and 10 packets to unknown port received right and 80 packets are sent right so if you want to see the statistics of uh, every interface then you can use minus s once again i'm going to press q to quit from uh, this command and then if you guesses guessed it correctly you can use minus st for tcp right and then uh, if you want to use uh, minus s u for udp okay so it's just going to show you the udp connections and so on now if you want to see the pids of uh, the related interfaces then you can use the p minus p option okay so for example you want to see the pid of all tcp connection which are there okay so press enter and you can see uh, the tcp connection and then you will be able to see the pid related but there is no pid related to because its uh, state is closed right so let's uh, quit and let's uh, just give the p state here okay so just give minus p and now you will be able to see the pids and the program names so for example we have the unix connection and uh, here is the pid of this and the name is daemon dbus dbus daemon okay and also you can see uh, the path and the state is connected here okay so if you want to see the pid of uh, this uh, you know program which is uh, using this connection then you can use the p flag okay and uh, obviously if you use t it will show you the tcp and if you use u it's going to show you the udp and if you're going to if you are going to use x it's going to use uh, show you the unix port connections okay now uh, if you want to uh, see the numeric ports then you use minus n okay minus st n stands for numeric and when i press enter then you can see it's going to show you the numeric ports which are used by different uh, you know interfaces on your system right once again i will press quit now uh, minus c flag is used to show you the network statistics continuously so i'm just removing the less command and when you use netstat minus c it's going to show you the status continuously you can see after some time this status is refreshing right so it's going to show you the status continuously once again i'm going to just press ctrl c to quit from this and uh, yes so minus c is for continuous okay now uh, there are many uh, options uh, which you can use with uh, this netstat one last important command i want to show you is the netstat ie command so netstat then i is for interface and e stands for extended interface so e is for extend and i stand for uh, interface right and when you give this command it's going to show you the same output which is given by 
if config command so when you give if config command it's going to show you the same output as the if config command gives okay so if you want to see uh, what you know connections you have on your system and what is the ip address and the broadcast address and mass then you can also use uh, netstat ie if if config is not available on your terminal okay now some more uh, things i want to show you here in the last video we have seen the grab command and this grab is really uh, helpful whenever for example you want to use the netstat command so you can use netstat and then we will use a for all and for numeric and then for example you want to search for uh, from the output some lines so for example i will use grab and grab is used to find uh, some content right in the last video we have learned this and then in the single quotes for example i want to see what are the ports from the output of netstat which has the port 80 in it okay which has this keyword 80 in it colon 80 okay and when i press enter you can see it's showing the output so this grab is taking the output from the netstat an command and then filtering the lines which have this keyword colon 80 okay so you can combine these command like this also okay and this pipe means here is that whatever is the output of the first command after this pipe whatever command is used is going to be implemented on the output of the first command okay so for example if you use less here then it's going to show you the output of the netstat command using less if you use grab here then it's going to show you the output of the netstat using grab okay so this is how you can use netstat in linux i hope you understood the basic concept of netstat and i hope you enjoyed this video please rate comment and subscribe and bye for now